The Amazon was a four-masted bag which left Batal but on the 31st of August 1908 carrying 2,000 tonnes of coal bound for Quique and Chile, South America. Far from being a glorious summer's end, clouds were gathering from overhead. The ship made it to Mumble's head but it was a filthy night at sea, and the master decided to drop anchor and wait until dawn before proceeding on the journey. By the next morning, the wind had strengthened. The sea had turned rough. High and deadly waves, powerful as a prize fighter, punched the deck and the hole. But in the house and within the tape. Before long, the wind was so strong, even the massively heavy anchor began to drag along the seabed, and the sailors started panicking. What were their chances of surviving such a deadly storm? Save yourselves, lads. Yeah, Tie yourselves down. down. Yell yeah, Captain Carey. Yeah, yeah. They lashed themselves to the morass and bulwarks and gritted their teeth in the face of the assailing wind and waves. I can't hold on much longer. These ropes are going to give. We're going to get blown away by this hurricane. We're all going to die. I can't hold on much longer. I ate the top. That morning, the Amazon had been blown back across Wandy Bay and was driven ashore on Marvin Sands. Now it was beginning to break the mat, the mass broke off like pencils snapped by an angry schoolboy. The 20 sailors who had lashed themselves to the main mast were washed away by the deadly waves, dashed upon the rocks and drowned. Captain Carrick himself was lost to the merciless might of the sea. Six dead, soaked, half-dead sailors managed to battle their way through the crashing surf to safety. Aided by brave local people who waded in to help them. I'm drowning. Pray God I should live. Here, take my hand before the next wave. The two broken wretches remain clinging to the wreck of the Amazon. Who would risk their lives in the eye of such a ferocious storm to save these poor souls? Fearless local volunteers on the rescue boat knew they were risking their own lives, but still, would they, get they rode through would, 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 the dead waters, straining on the oars with all their might. Would they get there in time? I can see them. Row, boys, row! Would they get there in time? Help me! Would, would they get there Pull in time? on those oars! The Coast Guard rocket apparatus fired rocket after rocket in the desperate attempt to save the terrified sailors. Would, 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 Finally, would they after many time? attempts, they got a line aboard. My leg is broken! We will rescue you, my lads! Would, Fire would, would, that would, would rocket! They get there in it's time? got there! Imagine how it felt to see that burning fire coming through the gloom to light up the sky like a bird of hope. The men were rescued, but the Amazon was finally torn to pieces and flung far and wide. The wreck can still be seen at low tide on Margam Sands, or is still washed up on local beaches. Who knows whether or not these nuggets are the last remains of the great cargo carried by the Amazon and lost in the great hurricane of Lincoln. Fire that rocket! Fire that rocket!